In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to change the font family and the font size in Word 2013. Currently on my computer, you can see that I have Word 2013 open and I'm in a blank document. My insertion point is flashing and I'm getting ready to enter some text. So I'm going to go ahead and enter in the word font. And as you can see, font is now on my screen. But now the question becomes, what font family is that? And what size is that font? Well, if I look up to my ribbon, I can see that I am currently in my home tab. And if I look in the font group, you'll see where it says Calibre, body, and next to it, you'll see where it says 11. What that means is the font that I am typing will be Calibre and it will be size 11. Calibre and size 11 is the default font family and font size of Microsoft Word 2013. But let's assume that I want to go ahead and change the font family and the font size for the word font. So I'm going to go ahead and select the word font by highlighting it or selecting it with my mouse. And when I let go, you will see a mini toolbar appears. And that mini toolbar, in many cases, replicates the area of the ribbon that I showed you previously. Again, let me go ahead and bring up the mini toolbar by highlighting the word. And there it is again. And if I go ahead and click on the drop down button or the down arrow next to where it says Calibre, I can see a variety of fonts that are available to me through Microsoft Word. And you can go ahead and scroll down and see even more fonts. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and select Arial Black by simply going ahead and clicking on it. And now, as you can see, the font family has changed, but the font size has not. Again, if I go ahead and click on the down arrow next to the number 11, I'm given a variety of sizes. And you can see as I'm scrolling over some of these sizes that I'm getting a live preview of how large that font size is. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and select 20. So now I have changed my font family to Arial Black and my font size to 20. I'm going to go ahead and click with my mouse next to where it says font to go ahead and deselect that text. The font family is Arial Black, the font size is 20, and I can go ahead and change it from the ribbon just like I did the mini toolbar. And now for demonstration purposes, I'm going to go ahead and change the font family and font size one more time. So I'm going to make sure that I'm in the Home tab in the font group. I'm going to go back to the font family, which currently says Arial Black, if I hit the drop down arrow, I'm going to switch it back to Calibre. I'm going to change the font size as well. Currently it's 20, as you can see. And if I click on the drop down arrow, I'm given a variety of options. However, let's pretend that I want to change my font size to 17 points, not 16, not 18, but 17. Well, I don't see 17 as an option here. So what I could always do is just go ahead and make sure that the font size is highlighted. Currently, the number 20 is highlighted. And if I go ahead and enter in one and seven on my keyboard, you can see that 17 now appears as the font size. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the drop down arrow at this point to make sure Calibre 17 is selected. And if I type in font two, you can see the font size is different and the font family is different as well. Now, before I close this video, I wanna show you one additional way that you can change font size. So at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and type in font three. And I'm gonna go ahead and highlight font three like so. And I want to draw your attention, not to the font family, not to the font size, but right next to it, you'll see a big A and a little a. 
The Big A will allow you to increase font size, and the Little A will allow you to decrease font size. So by simply pressing the button, you will be able to increase the font size marginally, as you can see, and by pressing the decreased font size, you'll be able to change it in the opposite direction. Some people prefer this method because it isn't so much a guessing game as to say, well, what number font do I need to use? They just do it by sight. As you can see, by simply clicking the increase button or the decrease button, like so. Well, there you have it. A variety of ways to change the font family and the font size on Microsoft Word 2013.